Thanks for tuning in, everybody. We're watching the remix series, a remix of drink we did before. We're doing it again today. We're doing a whiskey sour. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. <laughs> Cocktail. Thank you for joining me tonight, the start of the remix series. What's the remix series? Well, it's I'm taking some drinks. I made some old videos, making them again, maybe making them a little bit different, maybe just making the videos a little bit better, but either way, we're having some fun. And we're going back, going back to an old drink, going way back, 1872, a whiskey sour. Easy drink to drink, easy drink to make. Let's put it together. Let's have some fun with it. All right, and it's right in the name, whiskey, and I'm using Wilderness Trail, Kentucky Straight, uh, cask strength. This drink uh, really is a lot easier to drink than the 112, 112.95 uh, proof that it says right on the bottle. So be careful with this stuff, but it is a great drink and drink. I got two ounces already in my, um, in my, in my shot glass here, and I'm going to make it about two and a half ounces. That's about another half of, of this particular, of this particular whiskey. All right. So I'm going to need, um, for the sweet and sour of the whiskey sour, I want some simple syrup and I want an ounce of simple syrup and I am using store-bought. If you want to make your own, go right ahead. All right. So we've got the sweet. Now we want the sour. So for this, I'm going to do this. I'm going to have some fun with it. All right. So I'm going to use the juice of a lime going right into here. So the original recipes called for citrus. All right and uh weren't always all that specific so let's have some fun so the juice of a lime let's use the juice of a lemon thick skin on this lemon here a lot of juice on this lemon here that's good juice of a lemon juice of a lime and because we're remixing i've also got the juice of Half an orange I'm going to put in here as well. So again, a little extra flavor we're going to do with this as well. All right. So again, a lot of extra proof on this, on this particular bourbon. It's going to be able to handle this. Um, the extra citrus, the extra juice, the extra non-spirit quite nicely here. Okay. A little messy here, but that's all right. That's all right. So what else are we going to do that's a little bit different? A little bit of extra flavor here. Should have... Uh, there we go. Little cherry hearing, all right, which is gonna be in the drink and to play off what is the traditional garnish. And just about quarter ounce of that. And a couple of dashes of fee foam, all right. Now, if you put in, um, put in some egg white into your whiskey sour, all right, I think, uh, I think some people call that a Boston sour. I don't have any egg white handy. This actually adds a little body to the drink as well. So you throw a few drops of that into there. And in my shaker, I've got a lot of ice. I've got cubed and I've got crushed ice. And I'm going to shake this for a really, really good long time. I hope everybody's feeling good. Spring has definitely sprung, at least where I am. Some nice warm days. The playoffs are in full gear. For the Bruins, for the Celtics, so I've got some great things to watch. Hope we're going to get a few parades, a couple of parades this year. Ooh, this is nice and frosty on the outside. Oh, this smells wonderful. So traditionally, I've got the traditional garnish here with a maraschino cherry and a, uh, and a slice of orange. I'm going to strain this in over some cubed ice. And I'm going to leave just a little bit of room at the top. So I want to lengthen it out with just a touch of club soda. Okay. Just so there's enough room for all these flavors. I'm going to use my knife here to bounce off each other and mingle. And there we go, everybody. A whiskey sour. See how we did. That's an easy drink and drink. 
Cheers, everybody. Take care of each other. Call the people you love. Thanks for watching.